Hey guys, so we put together this video because we just came from ABGC, also known as a Video Game Con, in Persephone, New Jersey. Uh, just a great video game convention that uh, we just checked out the first time, and we thought we'd give you guys a little bit of uh, our experience of what we did there. So, if you don't know it, it's just a pretty much, uh, it was like a rented out hall, a gym or something like that, a bunch of different rooms. There was like a one room that was just for um, playing video games, there was just all these consoles set up to these different TVs, it was this huge room like in a gym, there was another room that was just for like distributors selling different types of like games, uh, art, all kinds of stuff about video game related. And then there was this other room, another arcade room, and it was kind of split in half. It was like half arcade and then there was like a band set up. And there were some rooms from some panels. There's a lot of cool people like cosplay. Yeah. We met a few fans too. Yeah. I guess we'll just talk about some of the things we did and experienced there. There was this really cool giant Lego old school Nintendo controller that was hooked up to a TV and you could actually play it. It was really weird. And it was hooked up to Tetris, and you could actually push down on these buttons. It was just this huge jumbo controller. I'd never seen anything like it. I thought it was really cool. A little slow. I mean, it was totally like a novelty thing, but you know, I, I enjoyed it. You know, I was like, oh my god, take a picture of me. This is so cool. I like the arcade. Uh, everything was free to play. They didn't have much pinball, which was kind of disappointing, but they had Tapper, which is one of my favorite arcade games, and I got third on it, and I <laughs> messed up the initials, so if you see AAA, that was me. And uh, I guess we should talk about what else we experienced in that arcade room. Should we? Yeah. So uh, there was a couple of celebrities there, I guess you could say. And yeah, yeah. Uh, besides these two. <laughs> and what we experienced was uh, the maker of this hot sauce, Ricky's hot sauce right here. That's right. We met the one and only Billy Mitchell. Billy Mitchell from the, uh, you know, all the record holder of all these games. And, Donkey Kong. Uh, yeah, Donkey Kong. Hey, man. Yeah. And we, I, I love King of Kong. It was one of my, oh, it's one of my favorite movies. And, uh, you know, he's the bad guy in that movie. So it's like, oh, man, should we, should we say hi to him? Like, I was so nervous. <laughs> and then, like, I was like, oh, Brett, we're doing it, we're doing it. We're just going to go up to him. And he's like, oh, I'm like, we're doing it, we're doing it. And I'm like, Mr. Mitchell, could I, uh, could I would like to say hi? And he's like, he's <laughs> Uh, Mr. Mitchell's my dad, you know, don't call me that. I was like, oh, okay, Billy. And I overheard that, so when I walked up, I said, hey, Billy. And he's like, yeah. And then he, like, asked us for our names. So he's like, hey. He goes to me, I like your shirt. And then he goes, Greg, hey, I like your shirt. I'm like, oh, okay. And then, can we get a photo? So then we got a photo, and then... And he says, well, you know what the problem with these things are. And he grabs our, our ladies. <laughs> And he took a photo with our lady, so I guess yeah. it was a... He took our girls, and he, and he just took a photo with both of them. <laughs> and, uh, and then I had to take the picture, and I was so nervous. I'm like, oh my god, it's Billy, I don't know why I was so nervous, and I'm shaking. And he took a picture, like, yeah, that's good! Thanks for saying hi to us, Billy Mitchell. I thought he was nice. He said hi to, he saw every, he said hi to everybody, he took photos with everybody, so, you know, what versus what the movie, versus what we actually saw, he seems like a nice guy. So, we saw Billy Mitchell. And that was pretty cool. And of course, what? It's a video game convention, so what are there? Video games! We bought lots of games. And let's uh, go over what we bought. I got a bunch of Game Boy games. I got Nemesis for Game Boy. This is the first game that I bought with my own money. And I still have it, but it doesn't work. I've tried everything to get it working, so I bought another copy. <clears throat> I also got uh, The Amazing Spider-Man. Just figured I'd check it out. I got Bart Simpson's Escape from Camp Deadly. I actually had this game growing up, so another copy. I got Super Off-Road. I thought this would be kind of like RC Pro-Am, but I popped it in the Game Boy, and it doesn't seem that great right now, so <laughs> might have uh, dropped the ball on that one. I got Wario World Incorporated. Uh, I have Wario Twisted for Game Boy Advance. It's a great game, so I wanted to get this. I also got Spiral Seasons of Ice. I tried it a little bit. It seems cool. And of course, a couple Super Nintendo games. I got Pool. I had this growing up, and Clue. And if I just looked at the clues of this game, you could see I paid four dollars for it. But on the back, you could see the seller got it for one ninety nine. So if I only checked the back of this, I probably could have knocked a dollar off the price from him. But live and learn. That's all the games I got. 
Alright, I'll go over here. I did buy a lot of games. A Wave Race 64, just, uh, there's no Wave Race games anymore. Why not? I love this game. Frustrating as hell, but I loved it. Wave Race 64, all the way. I got another N64 game, and it's uh, Blast Corps. I used to play this all the time. I brought it for my friend. I never actually owned it. A uh, good, cheap, five-buck game, and uh, another frustrating game for me on the N64, but I remember enjoying it a lot, so I thought I'd relive the nostalgia. Oh, another game I got. GameCube! Metroid Prime. I've been playing a lot of Metroid games lately. He's been uh, talking about Metroid. I can't. I'm really, past month. I'm really into Metroid now, again. So, Metroid Prime. And here's some maybe Console Wars related stuff. I got Mario All-Stars, a game I never actually owned. I played it a bunch of times. Own all the other Mario games, but never really did this for the, just the Super Nintendo. I already own all the Sonic games, and now I got the Mario game. I don't, what am I going to do? I don't know. Here's another Console Wars related purchase. So I got Vector Man. Oh, Vector Man, pretty cheap. I never actually owned it for Sega. I had the uh, collection for like the PlayStation 3, but Vector Man for Sega Genesis. And what's, what else do I have? I got Donkey Kong Country. Two games I've never owned that um, keep getting requests for, so maybe, I don't know. And got good old grab bags. So these are just random bags full of games. You pay $25 for these two bags, and it's random games. It's really just more of a fun little gimmicky thing. I don't expect to get anything great. But, I'm gonna open them for you right now. So let's start with Super Nintendo. Here we go. Ba -ba -boom. What could it be? Three games. Number one. Ah! Real Monsters. I used to watch a show all the time. Yeah. I remember when this game came out. I actually wanted it. And uh, now, now you have it. Now we're gonna it took a while, but... Uh, it's great. I love this show. I love it. that show. <laughs> I almost knocked my beer over. Number two game is... <gasps> Lion Whoa. King! Whoa! You guys have been requesting that one. Actually, I already own this one. So, wait, I own this one and the Sega one too. Ooh, ooh, we should get on that shit anyway. Here we go. Oh my god, Draken! Wow! I had this game when I was younger, and my mom bought this game, and it was such a bizarre game, and I can't. It's honestly, I love that I have this because the nostalgia for me is gonna go through the roof. Okay, now I'm gonna open up a new Genesis bag. Here we go. Boom. Again, three games. Number one, Air Diver. Hmm. I don't know what that is. <laughs> hey, a game I've never heard of or played. I'll take it. Number two, Super Battle Tank, War in the Gulf. Wow, I actually own the original Battle Tank. I never played it, I never understood it. My dad played it all the time. <laughs> So, in that game, I still try to play it. It's a little weird. Um, looking forward to playing the second one, though. And the third game is... Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Ah, uh, we already did one of these, but this is the TV show one, not the movie one. And I do actually own this one already. Maybe we'll do this one versus the Super Nintendo one. So those are my three grab bag gets. Not too bad. Any final words? I still really enjoyed it. I hope they keep doing it. So I would definitely go back. Yeah, I would go back for sure. It's really cool.